Good evening. A former Bishop of Lewis has been arrested by police investigating historic allegations of child sex abuse within the Diocese of Chichester. Bishop Peter Ball, who's 80, was detained at his home in Somerset this morning. A second retired priest, 67-year-old Father Vickery House, was also arrested today at his home near Haywards Heath. Our Home Affairs correspondent Colin Campbell reports. And what hurts us our hearts most? A former Bishop of Lewis and Bishop of Gloucester, the Right Reverend Peter Ball was arrested by Sussex police detectives at his home in Langport in Somerset this morning. The 80-year-old has been arrested on suspicion of eight sexual offences involving eight boys and young men in East Sussex and elsewhere during the late 80s and early 90s. Thirty years ago, while serving as the Bishop of Lewis, Bishop Peter Ball lived here at the old rectory in Littlington, East Sussex. Whilst here, he ran residential retreats for young people. Now, we understand the majority of allegations of sexual abuse that have been made centre on what's alleged to have happened here at that time. The second man detained is 67-year-old retired Church of England priest, Father Vickery House. Until 2010, he worked as the vicar of St Bartholomew's in Brighton, he was arrested at his home near Haywards Heath on suspicion of two separate sexual offences against two teenage boys. The offences, which are not being linked to Bishop Ball, are alleged to have taken place in East Sussex between 1981 and 1983. It's absolutely crucial that the church and the police cooperate fully and we're really pleased to, to understand that the church are doing exactly that. In a statement, the Diocese of Chichester told us Bishop Peter Ball has had no ministry in Sussex for many years. Father Vickery House has had his permission to officiate suspended and the diocese is working closely with Sussex police. Both retired priests have now been released to be interviewed at a later date. Bishop Peter Ball was not questioned today following medical advice. Colin Campbell reporting. He joins us live from Brighton Police Station. Colin, what more can you tell us about the arrests of Bishop Peter Ball and Father Vickery House? Well, Sussex Police say these arrests follow a complex six-month investigation called Operation Dunhill, which has resulted in Sussex Police detectives having to trace and speak to many people who are now adults. Uh, the investigation was kick-started in May this year when Lambeth Palace sent two files, a dossier of information, on to detectives here at Sussex Police. Now, it was a review of that information which resulted in the formal police investigation. Police say that the allegations had not been previously reported to them. They say there are no allegations of current or recent uh, offending or anything to suggest that young people are currently at risk. Okay, Colin, thank you very much.